Okay, so about three years ago, Aiden and I were in this town called Beatty. We happened to stop at a subway and we talked to a local there. I always love discussing haunted areas with locals because sometimes they have gems. And I'm gonna share with you this gem of a place that I have visited before, but I did not have the balls to go at nighttime until now. It took me some time. But as we were getting ready just to do a little drive-by, Aiden and I, there was a little old lady that stood right, right around here. I believe she worked here in the area. And she said, you guys are going over there with a real heavy accent. And we were like, no. <laughs> she was like, don't go over there. There's something dark in there. So she was referring to the witch's church. Got my boy James here with me. Now we are doing a video for James's channel. <sighs> Actually, we already filmed that video. <laughs> yeah, we did film that video. So yeah, cats out the bag. We, we, we have been in here before, but it's okay. Cause we warmed it up for you. And there, oh, oh my God. Oh, we definitely God. warmed it up for you guys. Uh, um, honestly, when we were leaving, I told James I didn't even want to go back. Yeah. And I, last time I was here, okay, I'm going to show you. This place is so haunted, they usually keep a cross right in the front. Yeah, there's the cross. And it's covered up, the door's closed, and I found it very strange that the cross was off to the side and the door was wide open. Now, on James's channel, we did an Estes method. Which yeah, he was is uh, telling me how crazy it was. I don't know yet. Yeah, you haven't even seen it. Seen it. I asked. A lot of stuff happened. Like when we left this place, there was so much activity happening. So, yeah, I, I'm be hoping prepared it's the for same. a lot. I hope. And I did bring the DR60. We're gonna use that in a little bit. Oh my God, I don't want to go back in. You know, it's such a bad feeling here, guys. We had the, like pins in our stomachs and some bad juju here for sure. Yeah, last time I came, this cross was right there. Door was closed, and it was almost like closed up here. You could see it says uh, Underground Stone Storehouse, 1908. Right? I had the date wrong. The structure has been used as a storehouse, club room, uh, Beatty Community Church. So it was a church, but I don't know why there's connection of it being associated with like witches and stuff it's kind of like a like a local legend so the last time james and i were here i had this very same flashlight you can see it's green which means that it's charged as i get right here it starts like just going dim on me see it's not doing it now okay locked it up all right thanks bro Oh, you know what was crazy is I asked, like when you were doing the Estes method, mm -hmm. I was like, why was the door open and the cross pushed to the side? And you immediately responded through the spirit box, because I like it. Really? Yeah. Oh my God, I can't wait to watch that later. Shh. Hello? Are you still in there? even want to go back in here i'm cringing right now but i mean we're here came a long way from florida oh oh, oh. what i don't know this door like moved as this one was going over there what uh -huh. that was weird okay we're back hello Close this up, dude. Oh, let's do this. Oh, yeah. We didn't do that last time. No. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> so much happened in here. It's just the feeling. I can't get over how bad the feeling is. I kept feeling dizzy. Yeah. It sounded like there was something walking up on the ceiling. I mean, you're going to have to make your way towards James's video. We did a completely different video. Back in the day, we used to film videos so different. We did. We like both be holding a camera. and. Yep. Film at the same time, and it was like right. the same type of video, you know. So I mean, we just edited different. We feel like you could get a lot more value 
just creating completely different videos and it's almost like a part one and a part two so mm -hmm. if you like that if you're a fan of that whenever i do collaborations with my boy james like let me know like actually yeah, yeah. it's a rhetorical question i know you like it but it's a different video did you bring your flashlight with you the same one yeah bro tell them what happened i did oh you didn't hear me one. yeah I I, how it was like that. it was going dim yeah but it's not doing it so now no no yeah. No, it was so literally as soon as we walked over the threshold, yeah. it started happening. It was, uh, I've never seen anything like it. I want to show some of that footage. Sure, yeah. Yeah, sure. Go ahead and show it. Here, I mean, and I even put it on the ground. So I'm going to do that right now. <clears throat> okay. By the way, guys, this video is completely uncut, unedited. Start recording, upload the clip as it is. So we're experiencing, you're experiencing it as we're experiencing it. Right. I love these kind of videos. Yeah, there's not going to be any cuts in this video. I mean, oh. Oh. What the hell? No music either. No sound effects. Nothing added. It's all raw footage. Remember, we were hearing all kinds of different noises in here. Sound like a voice. Can you come and dim that flashlight for me? Let me check. There's no animals in here, or rodents or anything. Oh God. That's crazy. You know what, man? How would you feel being in here like completely alone? It's a, that's a, that's a, not a good feeling. <laughs> I would do it, but. What's funny is <laughs> James was leaving like on his way out. And I was back there like messing with something. I forgot what it was. I think I was oh, I was trying to put put away my spirit box and put the batteries away and stuff. And he's walking out. I'm in the dark back there. I'm like, no, no, don't leave me. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. Hey, I don't blame you, bro. This place, like I said, it's off. It is very off. It's like something floating here. I see, maybe it's just some spider web. So, do you want to put on your spirit talker app so that if it just has anything to say while we're here? Like, it doesn't say a lot, but no. sometimes it's really good. The Spirit Talker in my video didn't really do much. It wasn't, like, very accurate, but I've seen it so accurate before. I'm actually going to use the other Spirit Talker, the Necrometer, the one that... Okay, that's not a consistent noise? Um, this is different. Okay. Let me see here. Oh, no. What was making that noise? It's the first question. Everything seems to be coming from the ceiling. Remember, it said something about look up on the spirit talker, and we looked yeah. up, and then it, like a knock or something. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. I like on cue too. That was cool. All right, this is my app right here, and we're gonna use a couple other things. I did bring my DR60, so that thing is cool. All right, this has to be on ring. Like your ring has to be on. I usually have my ringer off. So, um, it's not raining because we're in the desert. I don't know why. I mean, rain could be a name. So, I don't know. Thinking that. I'm going put to that, put that there. This flashlight's not even doing it. No. It goes to show you. Like, look, it's got a full, full charge. Like, so I don't know what was causing it to dim. Oh, what? Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh my god, you scared me, bro. You scared me, bro. I thought something literally just tapped me on the head or something. Yeah. Uh, what is this stuff? It's like hanging. Oh, it's uh, some old knob and tube wiring. I just noticed that. So this place had uh, some electricity. I just now noticed this. Yeah. Cool. Let me make sure I got this on. I don't think I... I think I have it on. All right. So there's going to be a couple little mess ups here. I would usually cut this out of a regular video. Ah, okay, move around. But yeah, I would usually cut things like that out, like me just, you know, making sure the spirit box is working correctly. But like James said, hey, can you put your phone on silent too, by the way? I thought it was your phone. That, that was, was your phone. phone. Yeah. Huh? I just turned my phone. Oh, I got to press the button. Ah, uh, Drink. Drink what? Well, one thing we did find kind of strange, and this has been here since last time. There's like a old Charlie Chaplin 
cut out. And then there's some, like it says, here lies Dirty Dingus McGee. <laughs> <laughs> Dirty Dingus McGee. Okay, that's not real. <laughs> <laughs> Shot while robbing Tonopah Tidewater Railroad. Yeah, we're not far from Tonopah, right? Believe like an hour. And Tonopah is where the Clown Motel is. Yes, sir. Yeah. And the Mispa Hotel. And the Mispa. Where am I? Oh, shh. There's someone back there? What was that? Now this isn't a very big place, which is why we kind of wanted to do like an uncut video like this because there's just so much that happens in this small area as far as spirit activity. So, I mean, you really don't need to go anywhere large. Mm. I mean, you could, some small houses are haunted. I've seen shacks and tiny homes be haunted. So, yeah. Suitcase. Suitcase. Is that a suitcase anywhere? No, I don't think so. So, spirit talkers, you know, they're not gonna always, oh, somebody's texting me, not gonna always be throwing out some accurate responses. It could be, I mean, it could be accurate, but sometimes it might just spit out just some random stuff. But, I don't know, what should we ask? Um, ask, um, I want to know what made those noises before, or who's here with us. And we still haven't found out, like, why did they call this the Witch's Church? I don't yeah, know, we I don't, don't know. Yeah. And I mean, I've asked tons of locals here in the area, and, and people know of it as the Witch's... Is this? There is this? There is what? Yeah, there's what? Do you hear a noise by the door? Oh. Is it just me, or...? I thought I heard something from the ceiling again. All right, I'm gonna leave that kind of room. Then oh, my sit down is a lot colder in here than earlier. Like a lot colder. I do got your on tripod, so sorry. Is anyone here with us? We'd like to can we talk to you, or can you knock on something for us? He's here with us. I'm gonna say something weird now sometimes. I don't know why, man, but even right now, like every time I look at that door after it's closed, I keep seeing it's like something pacing back and forth. Let me see if I could turn the camera on. It's like straight ahead. Dead. Dead. Do you Are see Are you dead? What keeps moving over there? There's somebody behind that door? Yeah. And um, there was a Coke can, and we asked, can you move the Coke can? Oh, yeah. So there's a Coke can right here. Let me see if I can, like, make it a little more rounder. And let's see if we could get something to maybe, like. There he is. Let's 
see if I can lower this a little bit. You literally saw him like start shaking and moving very giddy through. And bro, if that moves, I mean you know yeah, there's, no wind. there's no wind in here. Like nothing at all. Okay, if there is something dark in here like they claim a lot of the locals, can you come and kick that can? Patrick Swayze ghost style. Hmm. Remember when the like in the movie Ghost? Mm -hmm. They taught him how to move objects. Yeah, that was really cool. That's a good movie. That's okay. You don't have to do that. Maybe you don't have enough power to. <gasps> there it goes again. There it goes again. I don't know. Okay, you can you can make noises if you want. That's fine. To prove that it's actually a spirit, that it's actually you, can you do something like that? Oh! No, no way! No way! No freaking way! Bro, I, I don't know if it was that door or the outdoor, outer door. There's nobody here, right? Dude, I'm telling you, I saw somebody Bro, walking. That was so clear. That was it was so like clear. walking back and forth. Wait, is that open? No, that's not open, no. What the hell? Bro. <laughs> what the heck? Hey, you're about to run into a bunch of spider waves. Bro, literally as I said that, as I said that on cue, how does that happen like that on cue? I don't know though, man. I'm not convinced that that was like paranormal though. What, 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 bro, what was it then? You think it was the wind that was pushing on the door? Yeah. What, what wind? I mean, I don't know. We did hear some cats and dog. It could have been a cat. Bro, a cat? Uh, the cat that wanted to get in really bad. I mean, I'm not saying it's not paranormal, too. I just, uh, okay. you know. <laughs> you, you know what it is, guys? I'll be honest with you. Yeah. The truth of the matter, you know exactly what I'm going to say. The truth of the matter is, he wants to just pretend that it's not because it's going to freak him out more. I right, realize that was actually paranormal. So to keep himself like calm and collective, he'll just say, yeah, yeah, it was just that. He's done that many times before. It no helps, way, too, it when I'm scared. It does. Yeah, you're right. I I'm telling you. It's when true. we walked out of here earlier, we were here for like an hour, and on our way out, I'm like, eh, I'm good, like, we don't have to film anymore, like, and James is like, what are you talking about, bro, like, yeah. let's film for your channel, let's film a cool video, you mean, it's been a couple years since I've been here, so I just thought, you know, what the hey, I'm already here, but I, I Comment below, what do you guys think, I mean... I'd love someone to explain that to me. I love it. This is one of those places that would have been great on the Alone series because oh, yeah. I, I don't think anybody, not even locals, like to come in here, okay? It's that dark. That lady was trying to warn us. You, you do not come. When you came we back. caught a lot of evidence during the day. So I'm I'm really excited. I mean, we're not, we're going to stay. We caught a little bit in that one hour we were here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're already catching some stuff. So there's something obviously here that wants to communicate. I don't know its story and, and it, like the entire story. Oh. Whatever it is likes the freaking ceiling. I'll tell you that right now. I mean, you think there could just be an animal up there? I mean, maybe. Possibly, but there's not much of a gap from where the roof is. It's like it doesn't have an attic. Mm. We're underground right now, too, guys. Just want you to know that. All right, I'm gonna prop you up on this. I might make a little noise. There we go. A little dark. Okay, sorry. That's stuff that I would cut out. Do you see it so you can see it when you're editing? Or you're actually not editing, you just put it up. Yeah, it's a wrong. When you premiere it or something. Alright. I'm gonna shine a little light here. Oops. 
Oops, sorry. All right, we're good. Put that right there. Oh, don't like that angle. That's good. Bam. Too much light. Too much light. Okay. Oh gosh, there's so many spoilers. All right, screw it. This is what I get. That was me. That was me. Look, Mom, what's a spoiler? All right, James and I were playing around with the DR60, and I was explaining it on his channel what this is. My boy exploring with Josh explained it pretty good, too. He got the date wrong, but that's okay. This was made, I believe, in the night, I think it was like 1994, early 90s, and it was the first like digital recorder of its time. I want to say they, you know, were $15, could be less. They're three thousand dollars or more now reason why they're so expensive is because they don't make these anymore and whatever technology they used in these actually connected with the spirit world in so many different ways and i'm so excited to use it here tonight people it was really crazy yeah people were returning these back to the store because they were getting so creeped out that things were appearing in their recordings that weren't there audibly like you couldn't hear them and they, they would pop up in these recordings people seem to believe in, including a lot of paranormal investigators that whatever technology is in the chip of the dr60 that can't be duplicated by the way anymore that's why they're so expensive and hard to find is some sort of connection with the paranormal world so we're gonna give it a whirl no Bro, that was the king. Did you got that on camera, bro? Did that move? Bro, you didn't hear it? I did hear it, but I thought you were over there kicking bro, it. I was literally standing right behind you. I literally was standing right. You, were you facing the camera toward us? Yeah. Bro, yeah. I was literally standing right behind you. No way. What the heck? Bro, you know that's not wind, bro. No, but you bumped into it earlier. Maybe it was no, at an angle. No, no. What? All right, all right, all right. I'm look. standing behind you, bro. Uh, you can't get those blow, blow, blow. Yeah. Bro, I don't. I thought you kicked it or something. I'm, I, bro, listen. I literally, I'm not even. But joking. James did look, say he did say that he was right behind you, like literally right here. No, I saw you. And it didn't sound like it was strong or anything. Like literally, I don't know. Maybe because he did bump into it just a couple minutes ago. So maybe. Huh. Well, I'm not You're, saying. He's look, doing it again, fam. He's look, doing it again. Uh, <laughs> look, we're gonna ask. Okay, we're gonna ask. All right, here we go. All right, just leave it on. Let's see if it does it again. Bro, I cannot. I, that blows my mind. Um, okay. Chomp, still learning how to use this. Did you hear that yeah, laughing? I just heard a woman. Shh. I just heard a woman laughing. And now I hear a dog. All right. All right, here we go. Is there anyone here that can explain the can being messed with right now? Was that James that ran into it? Or was it something else? You know, I've never thought about putting this, like, setting this up. I'm not supposed to talk. Oh, sorry. But that's cool. Why is this called the witch's church? What are all these sounds we're hearing all around us right now? You heard that? Mm -hmm. Ask who, who it, it, who it sounded it. like the church pews were like being rocked back and forth. Somebody like sat on it. It could have been that too. It was like it went. All right, I want to play this like slow motion. Is there anyone here that can explain the can being messed with right now? Was that 
James that ran into it, or was it something else? <laughs> Why is this called the Witch's Church? What are all these sounds we're hearing all around us right now? All right, I don't think it picked up anything on that one. Okay, let's do it again. Ask for a name of who touched the cocaine. Okay. All right, we got to be silent, silent, silent. Yep, I won't move. Okay. All right, here we go. Um, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go a little. I'm gonna hold this out. A local told me that there was something dark that resided in this underground church. Is that true? What's making noises in the witch's church? Is this place really evil? Are you a good spirit? or an evil spirit. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so the way this works is it only keeps recording if it's hearing something or picking it up. Chances are, probably didn't get much on this either, but, you know, give it a whirl. Let's see. That wasn't there. No. They heard it wasn't there. Good spirit or an evil spirit. Bro. Dude, so look, on, on the second one, because we did record a little bit on James's last video, and we had something. It, we we asked a question, and it yeah. said yes. Yeah. It said yes. Perfect but yes. A lot wasn't coming out, but on three, I want to see if I could slow that down. Oh, my God. That would, we got some really good responses. Like, you know you heard something. We just can't make it out yet. Right. Dude, that's incredible. It was completely silent. Let's see if I could do it again. Uh, okay. A local told me that there was something dark that resided in this underground church. Is that true? Bro, what the hell was that? Bro, what the hell was that? Bro. I don't know. What I, dude, I'm, I'm freaked out. I don't like using this thing. Bro, like those that. are full-blown responses. Yeah, I know, but then something happened. I know, I know, I know, but I'm saying those were full-blown responses, bro, and I was getting goosebumps. Then that happened. Wait. Dude, no way. I thought I just seen something fly. Dude, what the hell? I'm going to see if I can slow that down.
I'm going to say neither. Neither. You know what's funny? So the very first one, when it talks, I swear right before it starts talking, it like clears its throat. It's like, <clears throat> and then talks. This is, this is on Jay's video. Said yeah. So you can see we weren't getting we weren't getting very many responses on the first two, but holy crap, did we get some good responses? Wow. Wow. This has been insane, bro. Wow, I freaking can't, like, then that, oh my god. Let me see if I can... That, that, that was James. Oh, that was me. That was you. Yeah. So, yeah, you can see, like, it doesn't always work. Like, you're not always going to get these crazy responses, but... I, um... I'm going to get a little closer. I'm going to go to the pews, and we're going to ask some questions over there. Because we heard some noises. I mean, as we were asking these questions, something like... I don't know. And James swears that that can started moving again. I did hear it. But I thought maybe, you know when you step on a, a can and, and it like, crinkles back or and something? it crinkles back, maybe uh, it was bro, that. I, I literally uncrinkled it when I put it on there. Okay. I mean, you can see right there, there's the can. Like, it didn't sound like a pop, like a yeah. pop, it sounded like a blow, like it rolled a little bit. Huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, let's try this again. Oh. Gotcha. On the church pew. Actually, it's not a good idea. I'll just do this. Oh. Sorry. We do have to do a couple adjustments. All right, man. Pretty good. Some lighting. Uh, a lot of spoilers. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. Um, gosh, I'm scared to like ask any more questions. Well, we just heard that noise right there where you had, so I'm a little nervous being over here when you said you wanted to come back over this way. Okay. I haven't used this, I don't think ever in a video until now. So I'm uh, definitely getting out of my comfort zone here. Are there any other spirits here in this church that want to communicate with us? Perhaps you're a spirit that is not evil, that people are calling evil. Or you're something else that disguises as good, but actually is evil. What is it? Don't lie to me. Okay, there is a dog barking in the background. I don't know if that's going to cause this to I mean actually you'll hear it if it's if it is a dog all right let's see if we got anything on that so I'm gonna go ahead and push play Absolutely nothing. Oh, none of those? Okay. Yeah, nothing. Oh. 
Yeah, nothing on that. It just shows you, like, you know, it's just, you don't always get something. Are there any other spirits here in this church that want to communicate with us? Perhaps you're a spirit that is not so the, the reason it's just going through my voices like that is because it's only going to record when it's hearing something or picking something up. It didn't even pick up that dog that we heard in the background right now. So those intelligent responses that we got that I was sharing with you, uh, I think it was on number three. Hello? Somebody there? Listen, listen. Is there someone there? What do you want? We just heard the door. Was that you? Listen, listen. Bro, what the hell is that? Oh. What the freak? Dude, listen to the ceiling. Yo, what the freak? Sounds like there's somebody walking up. On the freaking ceiling right now. What the? I hope nobody's messing around out there. This place is just weird, bro. It is just different. I'm going to play some of whatever I just recorded right now. Me, me, I think it said me. Oh, I gotta rewind that. That was really good. Yeah, yeah. I, I heard a lot more the second time. I thought I said me and then and then and then and then. If there's someone there, who do you want? We just heard the door. Was that you? Wow. Bro, what the freak is that? Bro, wait till we listen to that with headphones, bro. Oh my God. Well, it almost sounds like when I asked, like, what do you want? It said nothing. Like you heard that it was like nothing. That could that maybe that's what it was, and then it said that it said like a few things. All right, I'm gonna ask again. That's incredible. Well, I'm not gonna ask the same question again, but are we in any danger being here in the underground witch's church? Okay, there is a truck outside. The air brakes. Making some noises. Okay, yeah. Oh, not everything's paranormal. Hmm. But I want to know what is paranormal in this underground church? Do you intend to do harm? If you hear it playing, like just my questions, that means that it didn't pick anything up because it's only going to record sound. So let's. Are we in any danger being here in the underground witch's church? 
What the fudge was that, bro? Dude, listen, what listen, listen, that? listen, listen. Oh my god, that sounded like a damn that demon. That gave me freaking bro. goosebumps. Yes, me Hold too. On. Oh my god. That was like it oh yelled my like god. a demonic. Oh my god. Oh my I do god. Not like that. I don't like that. Oh my god. Hold on. I gotta rewind that. I gotta get to that again. That was scary, bro. Oh my god. No, that was not the truck. The truck was way in the background. Whoa, dude! That, I'm telling you, the the noise that we heard it was like a truck from like way back. It was just going. Yeah. Yeah. This sounded like it was right there, just going. Like it screamed. <sighs> yeah, like you're right. Like it screamed. Yeah, absolutely. I'm gonna ask who's screaming. Who's screaming into my device right now? And why are you screaming? Just want to let you know we are not scared. Where are you right now? Let's see if it caught something. Who's screaming into my device right now? And why are you screaming? Just want to let you know we are not scared. I think that was James. That, that didn't pick up. See, that didn't pick up anything. No. Well, yeah, I caught you in the background talking. Oh, I talked to you. Um. Well, when you were like, I, I forgot what you said. No. You said something, but um. Okay. Yeah. Uh. I'm a. Uh, I'm a little freaked out right now. I. Uh, I want to know what you guys think about that. That that yell, scream, demonic noise. Like you're right. Like. The, the stuff we hear in the background is a light noise. That sounded like it was literally the like it was. You, you're hearing Omar talk, right? It was like ten times louder than Omar was talking, yeah. and that would have oh, been like this. You know what I mean? <laughs> so uh, I'm just saying that's what it sounded like. Huh? I want to ask what dimmed my flashlight mm. when we came here earlier. What's the dog barking? Yeah, but some scratching. What dimmed my flashlight when I came earlier? Do you want us to stay a little longer to talk to you? Are you enjoying our company right now? Are you from heaven or are you from hell? Okay. Bro, I don't want to hear anything crazy like that again. I'm actually scared to push play. I know, I'm actually scared to push play on this. Like after what over there, and then, uh, oh my gosh! All right, let's do it. This may be the last one.
showing our company right now? Are you from heaven or are you from hell? You got a little something on a the little, last one. Little something. Yeah, so a little something on the last one. That didn't pick up anything. No. There it did pick up something at the very, very end, but I, I, Before it sounded like sentences or several words being put together. Yeah, there was a lot. It, you know what I? I don't know if I want to ask any more questions, for the simple fact that the last response that I got was like a a freaking scream, like a it was almost like annoyed with us, like it was just trying to scare us off. Yeah, exactly. And maybe it's uh charging up right now to do something really evil to us. I don't know. I don't want to, I don't really want to find out. I don't know. What do you think? I think maybe like it's getting annoyed because anybody else usually would be in here. And like we were listening to the thing and all of a sudden we heard whatever that was over here, like they would have ran out. But like, we were like into it, like we're kind of scared, but also very interested. And I think that would confuse some spirits, not all spirits, but I don't know. Every spirit's different. I mean, we really don't know. That's the thing, guys. We don't know. Cool. It's going to follow me. Man. That's so cool. Yeah. I'm going to do one, like, kind of here in the darkness, because this is where I kept hearing some noises earlier. And I almost thought I saw something behind here. So, um, I kind of regret doing this, but... <laughs> you just said we weren't going to do it. <laughs> All right, this is the last one. It's the last one. Okay, this is the last time that I'm going to reach out to you. I'm going to give you the opportunity to say whatever you feel, whatever it is that you want to say. I'm sorry if I offended you in any way. I just want to get your story out there because I want to know more about you, even if you are evil. I just want to know, where did you come from? I mean, a lot of people don't know. Is this something from an evil world or is something from an alternate universe? I'm open-minded. Where are you from? Why do people say that you're dark? Sound like something fell, like from the ceiling or something. You know, it could have been, could have been like some of those rocks right there. All right, yeah. Like, oh look, it's like a glory hole. Really? What's that glory hole? Back. What? What's a glory hole? I don't know. All right. Um. Yeah, it sounded like a rock fell from the wall. Man, that could have. You know what a glory hole is? Fifty yeah, bucks. Fifty. <laughs> Just kidding. This guy. Yeah. All right. Let me bro, this has been crazy, bro. This is actually like even crazier than my video. I and mean, I didn't think that was going to be possible. This is wild. All right. Um, let's play this back. Oh, yeah. It actually recorded a minute of something. So I don't know what it recorded. Let's see. Okay. This is the last time that I'm going to reach out to you. I'm going to give you the opportunity to say whatever you Whatever it is that you want to say, I'm sorry if I offended you in any way, just want to get your story out there because I want to know more about you, even if you are evil, I just want to know, where did you come from? I mean, a lot of people yeah, don't know, is this something from an evil world or is something from an alternate universe? I'm open-minded. Where are you from? Why do people say that you're dark? No, the thing is, is when I would stop, and oh, yeah, it, yeah. it's obviously not picking anything up. Yeah. So that's the problem. Yeah, it didn't pick up any of those towers. <laughs> Talk about glory. 
<laughs> Whoa, what was that? I don't know. It caught something there. It did. Well, maybe that's what it caught, the rock falling from the wall. Or the water is. No, it sounded... I don't know. It might have been the noise that you that you heard. I don't want to piss this thing off mm. anymore because it screamed and that was almost the last thing that I heard from it. So anytime that I'm not using this, I have used this like personally, I just take the batteries out because, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I just don't want to mess. Well, I don't take the batteries out, but I take it out and I reverse it to go back the other way. So... Um, I want to show you around in here a little bit more. And this is, uh, this is James's favorite place right there. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you, that, that, that didn't just happen by itself. It came before. No. It did sound, look, it sounded like a crinkle. Like, it was like a... That, I don't know. Maybe I have to go back and listen yeah, to the footage. Really but that was really cool. We may have caught some other stuff too. Saw on camera maybe move, but I don't yeah. Know. Yeah, you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, I think a rock did kind of fall from the wall. As it was, because it was a kind of like a subtle like. I thought maybe it was a rat or something. That really makes sense though, because before when we were filming for my video, something crazy happened and like. You scared me so much that I backed up, uh -huh. and then all of a sudden, like a bunch of pieces fell. So maybe I loosened it up or something. Ah, uh, okay. I'm all right. That spot. So we're getting ready to leave here. Witch's ghost, or whatever you are, that hides here in the darkness. Hey, you want to hang out in the dark? Like by yourself? No. Yeah, I don't either. <laughs> um, James is available. He uh, wants to hang out. I'm going to make my way towards the exit. And I'm going to lock James in. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. So, yeah, hey. Uh, this is the Witch's Church. It's kind of a small place. But it doesn't fail to disappoint. A lot of people have come here. It's kind of like the local spot for paranormal enthusiasts, paranormal investigators. You know, not far from Las Vegas. Pretty neat place. Oh, bro, what the hell was that? Okay, I hope the camera caught that. That was weird. Yeah, it was like a... I don't know. That was, it was inside here. All right. Um, it was definitely a fun adventure. <laughs> if you caught anything, maybe that we didn't see, maybe a shadow or something strange, an anomaly or whatnot, please let me know. Tag me on Twitter or Instagram. I'm still going to call it Twitter. I know it's X me too. now, me but too. it's it's Twitter. Yeah, it is. Um, sorry, Elon. We love you, but <laughs> uh, we, we still like the Twitter name. But yeah, tag nice me. Try. Tag me in it. Tag me in like a screenshot. A lot of you are really good. At doing that mm -hmm. uh, send me a private email if you like a message I don't know exactly what was coming through that that spirit box uh, not a spirit box but recorder that recording device the DR60 but yeah I, I don't think I want to come back in here again and I'm definitely going to be saying a prayer here right when right when I leave actually you know what let's go ahead and close this video out with a prayer I've never done that in any video oh, before yeah. You know, so um, that way we could keep y'all at home safe, too, because people have reported after watching one of our videos that, you know, weird stuff starts happening in their true story. So weird stuff starts happening in, in their house. And we don't want any type of evil or anything to get conjured up by, you know, our viewers at home. We want y'all to be safe, too. So, <sighs> Father God, I just want to thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to explore and document you know, the spirit world, there's a lot that we don't know about it, and we are very open-minded when it comes to it. With that said, we just want you to protect us, protect the viewers at home, uh, whatever's here. God, we do believe that it could be dark, it could be evil. A majority of some of the things we document are from an evil place, and we're not here to show it any glory we're here to document it and just to prove that the spirit world is real and you're real. And in Jesus' name, we just ask for your layer of protection. We thank you for your protection tonight. 
that we weren't injured, we weren't hurt in any way. Uh, of course, the viewers at home pray for nothing but blessings in their lives and um, an awesome experience if they plan on doing something like this. God, I pray for safety over their lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. All right, fam. So that's going to do it for this video. I do appreciate it. If you want to see more videos that are kind of raw and uncut like this, I don't do them a lot. But James and I, we're going to actually be filming a lot here in the future just kind of raw and uncut and doing some more videos like this because yeah, a lot of you, if you like them yeah better than the other regular videos or, or the same a yeah. lot of people do seem to like when we don't have like music and right things like that i'm not gonna a lie lot of people really appreciate it too actually it's a lot easier it's a lot easier like sometimes it takes me an entire week i mean i i love editing videos but sometimes it does take a lot from our time you know to do things especially you know if you watch my vlogs life on the farm and things like that so i mean i would definitely appreciate mm -hmm. if you did like it a lot more but i i don't think it's something that i'm gonna do all the time but we, we are gonna be doing I might. you might <laughs> yeah. i mean hey if you if you love it and you enjoy it and yeah. you want to see more of it i do plan on doing more of it but yeah thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy it smash that like button be sure to check out james's video because we did do another part it was like a part one to this video and I also filmed with my boy Aiden Escapades and that was three years ago if you want to watch some of that video that was during the day and we did catch some really cool stuff didn't think I'd be back here at nighttime but we made it and uh, kudos to both me and my boy James so mm -hmm. yeah pat on the back because we made it um, well we still got to make it out the front door but <laughs> no. what is somebody out there bro listen listen listen, listen. It was that little old lady that a couple years ago told me, I was thinking. don't go in there. It sounded just like her. She was like, there's something dark, something dark in there. Wow, that was crazy. I'm going to keep rolling on our way out. So just in case. Yeah. So yeah, video's not officially over because I don't know what we're going to find outside we're gonna get ambushed by someone why are you doing that you see we're going out there on the road the other door's still off oh really what it's dark oh my light just died your light died yeah, yeah which know. makes sense i just filmed two videos but <laughs> i'm gonna grab this what no. hey scare me oh, yeah. I do have my flashlight. Oh, I'm scared. That actually scared me for a minute, too. I mean, I heard the woman. You heard that woman, too, right? Yeah. Just saw a car go by. Yeah. I mean, there's people right here, so. It's just, I think it's just normal. Yeah, it's kind of like in the neighborhood. Oh, bro, you're so dirty. Oh, my God. I mean, I'm probably dirty, too. Those... I'm getting ready to go do overnight in a ghost town right now, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a lot more dirtier. That oh. video's coming soon. Man, you're going to get in my car now like that. We got to shake you off. You can brush it off. See if you see a woman out there. You're right. I can't see anything, bro. I see black. Mm -mm. I don't see anybody. No. Bro, something just touched my head right now. Oh, duh. <laughs> it was that. That's what happened to me. Right okay. There. All right, we're safe. All right. We're good. All right, yeah. Um, and this is how we left it. This is how it was. Had the door wide open like that. It usually has a cross right on the door with the doors closed. So, um, 
Shout out to my boy James for joining me on this adventure. Please check out his video. It's awesome. All right, fam. Got to go for now before you leave. Oh, I got to change it back on me. Give me keys. Peace.